Today on Jenna's Corner, we're talking about the parts of the driving harness and what they do. Viewers, we're going on a field trip today. Unfortunately, it's just to the garage. We'll see you there. Welcome to the garage. Now we're going to show you some parts of the driving harness. This is the driving bridle. Here's the brow band. And these are the rosettes. They're basically decorations. This is a blinker. It's sometimes called a winker or a blinder. And here's the nose band. Goes around the nose. These are the lines. They're sometimes called reins. This is the bit. It's a broken snaffle bit. It's a very gentle bit. I'm going to show you another type of bit. This is another common type of driving bit called a Liverpool. This is the collar. It goes around the horse's neck. This is called a full collar. And it's made of patent leather and leather. Some driving harnesses just have a breast strap called a breast collar. This brass metal part is called the Hanes. And they usually attach to the collar. And if you look here, you see that there are some rain turrets. And I'm going to explain what rain turrets are later. Now you can see how the hands attach around the collar. And they attach it to the rest of the harness. And you can see how the hand connects to this part here, which connects to the straight that connects to the cart. And the horse pulls on the collar so that the collar goes back to the traces and the traces pull on the cart. Next I want to show you the saddle and this padding underneath it and it holds up the weight of the fills. The fills are the poles on the cart that come out and connect to the saddle. You'll have a piece like this called the tubs that, and the fills go straight through here and this connects to the saddle. Now this is the Cooper and this is the Cooper dock and it fastens under the tail and it helps hold up the harness in place. Now this piece that goes across the crouper is called the loin strap. And the loin strap goes down to the breeching and helps hold it up. Now the breeching is super important. It fastens around the horse's rear end and helps stop the car. I'll tell you how. From the front of the breeching is the ring. And from this ring you'll fasten a strap to the car. And when the horse stops, that, the cart pushes up against the breeching, and that, then it pushes up against the horse's rear end. That's how we stop the cart. Now this piece that goes from the saddle to the crimper is the back band. And these are the rain turrets. The reins fasten through these and run up to the cart. Now this piece here that fastens onto the saddle is called the girth. And just like a riding, it helps hold the saddle in place. Now you know some of the parts of the driving harness. Thanks for tuning in to Dennis Warner. See you next time.